Kia ora everyone and magandang araw po sa inyong lahat. I am Jessica Rose McEwen, representing the Filipino community of Wangarei, New Zealand. Wangarei, New Zealand. The subtropical city by the sea. Home to the population of more than 87,000 who take pride in protecting and preserving their environment. Here, we have various marine, scenic and forest reserves including the famous Wangarei Falls. Blessed with a subtropical climate and superb sceneries, Wangarei is nestled between forest-clad hills at the heart of the beautiful Wangarei Harbour. I was born and raised on a two-acre farm in Otaika, just south of Wangarei. Growing up as an only child, I explored every inch of nature in our backyard. In 2006, I moved to the Philippines. The country that I now call my home. I am a major green thumb and I got that from my father. I like to grow plants from seed and tend to them each and every single day. Our house is surrounded in different kinds of flowers and fruit trees. Such as chico, papaya, banana, suha, dragon fruit, mangoes, lanka, and other kinds of plants like malungai, tomatoes, and bamboo. I am also a pet lover, and I'm not just talking about cats and dogs. We have fish, chicken, and lovebirds. My parents established a school in the Philippines, and we believe that surrounding the children in nature and trees can really give a positive effect on them, not just for their health, but also teach them how to appreciate the environment. I want to include nature studies in the elementary curriculum so students from a young age learn about our earth and the environment that they live in. At the start of the school year, each child will grow a seed or seedling of a plant of their choice and they will tend to it for the rest of the school year. They won't just be learning about nature and agriculture, but they'll contribute a lot to the environment. The children are our future and I believe if they are taught and moulded at a young age they will bring these values when they grow up. Along the way they will be restoring and beautifying our lovely earth for the future generations. There are countless nature reserves in New Zealand that are well taken care of so I decided to choose the untapped place here in Pampanga, my hometown, which is Nabokolo. As you can see, this is an abandoned zip line. It was started many years ago, but it hasn't been finished yet. If they were to continue this tourist destination, it won't just help the ecotourism of Nabokolo, but it'll also help the livelihood of the natives who live here, the Aethas. If only everybody else could see the beauty of this environment. Plants are a big part of our environment and planting more can help reduce climate change. We only have one earth and it only takes one move to get on the right track of saving our environment. Let's all be responsible and follow the five R's. Rethink, reduce, reuse, recycle and respect. If I could add one more R, I would add replenish. Sometimes we forget to give back to Mother Earth. One tree falls, plant three more. Miss Earth Philippines is a privilege and honour to every woman, but there's more beyond the title. It's a crown that gives you a voice to be heard. It's an instrument of hope that puts a hard-working woman with a purpose on a pedestal to educate the population to come together to save the environment. And that is a responsibility I'd gladly work for. I am Jessica Rose McEwen, Miss Philippines Earth 2017, Wangarei, New Zealand, and I am a woman of the earth.